Hi there, my name is Leland, a support engineer here at AdThis, and we're pleased to announce our official support for the IAB Europe Transparency and Consent Framework. The IAB EU Consent Framework is a cross-industry effort to help publishers, third-party technology vendors, and advertisers meet the transparency and user choice requirements of the General Data Protection Regulation, also known as GDPR. Websites that receive EU traffic can upgrade their consent tool to the IAB EU Consent Framework. The IAB EU Consent Framework provides website visitors a simple, straightforward, and transparent method to give consent for the collection of their data that contains information on how website visitors' data is used, including how third-party partners use it. The IAB EU Consent Framework also enables websites to collect and transmit consent signals to third parties. There are many consent management providers, each with their own advantages. Which one you will choose will depend on your particular needs, so it is important to research each one before selecting and implementing a consent management provider. To make things easier, here are a few examples of IAB consent management providers available today. For this tutorial, I will be showing you how you can set up SourcePoint Consent Tool, a self-service consent management tool that is easy to use, easy to install, customizable, and can be installed on your website quickly. Best of all, it's free! To set up SourcePoint's consent tool, first go to this URL. Then, click on Get Started for Free to sign up for an account. From here, just enter in your information, and once you fill that in, click on Get Started. In this section, you can customize the pop-up's user interface and targeting behavior. There are three layout positions you can choose from, either having the pop-up modal up front and center, positioned on the top of your page like so, or on the bottom. Each layout provides you with the same content and features, it just rearranges the structure of the tool. I will select the center layout. You can also customize the title, description, button text of the initial consent pop-up. So I'm going to customize this text to meet my site's requirements. Once you've selected your preferred layout and customized the text, you can change the color of the buttons within the pop-up window so it can match your site's branding. For the types of users that should be asked for consent, customize the tool per your site's audience and requirements. The available options are All EU Countries and All Countries. For the purposes of this demonstration, I will select All EU Countries. Once you're done configuring the user interface and targeting behavior, just click Next. In this second section, you can select the IAB vendors who you may share the cookie data with, or you can just select to add all the IAB vendors. For the purposes of this demonstration, I will select Add All IAB Vendors. You can also configure whether you would like the default consent toggle buttons to be set to On or Off. For the purposes of this demonstration, I'll select Opt In to All Vendors by default. Next, you can link your privacy policy within the consent tool. This is optional, but I'm going to insert the link to my privacy policy, which will provide users with more information on my data collection and processing activities. Almost done. Here, you can customize the title and description of this data purpose modal, so I'm going to customize this text to meet my site's requirements. Now, just apply the finishing touches to your user interface by customizing the button and text color, and once you're done, click Next. This last step shows instructions on how you can install SourcePoint's consent tool to your website. First, click the toggle switch to the right. Then, just copy the code snippet provided and paste the code into your site's HTML, right before the closing body tag. For WordPress sites, the closing body tag section can usually be found in your footer.php theme file, and so I'm going to paste it right before there. Lastly, just save the changes, go back to your website, and do a hard refresh, and the source point consent tool should appear! Now your website is more transparent about what data it collects, how it uses it, and the various vendors involved, allowing your users to have further control over their data. That's it! If you have any questions, please feel free to email help at addthis.com or send us a tweet at addthissupport, and our fabulous support team will be there to assist you. Thanks!